What's up guys, welcome back to another video. We gotta switch up this intro. We gotta do something a little bit different. I don't know what to say though, so just bear with me. We'll, we'll figure it out, but as for now, it'll be the same. But I don't like it, so we gotta change it. Um, but anyways, we're heading to the finale of the US Sprint Duro Series. Uh, it's been a, been a crazy year for the Sprint Duros for myself. Uh, you know, breaking my hand at round two. Having some good results, having some bad results, it's all part of the game. But uh, yeah, we're heading there now. It's somewhere in Maryland, kind of like in the tip by West Virginia in uh, Pennsylvania. We're going solo. Taylor isn't with me, unfortunately. But uh, she's at Spring Creek this weekend, and this past week I was at the Duval Compound, Duval Ranch. Big shout out to Thad and Maggie for opening up their house to me. and. Uh, let me come stay for a few days and get some good practice in so with that being said we're going to the race feeling good like I said it's the finale and we're ready to do some damage we're uh, we're pretty close second and third me and Nelka are really close in points right now but um, yeah we're not gonna try not to think about it honestly just move forward and ride the best I can So two tests down, uh, did the endure test first, cross test second, about to head out there and do it again. Um, this time just really memorizing each turn, each straightaway, knowing what lines exactly I'm going to hit um, just so tonight I get a good visual visualization um, of the track in my head. Obviously I'm going to ride it again tomorrow morning, probably twice, so um, this won't be my last time. but. Uh, this is a good time to really memorize it and um, head to the hotel thinking about it. So the first time through was just looking at the track, looking at different lines. And then the second time through right now, I'm just going to go check out the lines. Not check out the lines. I'm going to go uh, ride the test and know exactly where I'm going to go. And that's the lines I'm going to be committed to. So I want to say I'm lost but Taylor definitely helps out on the food department, especially at races, so I'm not really sure what to get because I'm gonna have to prepare everything myself. So I wanna make it as easy as possible. So I'm thinking about getting some apples and some oranges, maybe some peanut butter. I don't know, dang. Hopefully she doesn't see this. She's gonna get a big head after I said that. I am parking. Oh, that was a pretty good one, Tanner. Timmy. Leon, who was ever up to it, did not expect it, but that was pretty good. I guess I didn't get them all. Oh my gosh. I think that's the end of it, but I'm not going to hold my breath. Because who knows what else they did. They got me so good. Uh, this one's going to be hard to beat. What do you think? Last round. Last round. Been out here. Ready to win one. Let's do it. Last chance. Yeah, that's right. Last chance of 2021. We're right across the street from the donut place. Going with the blue stuff today pretty hot today uh, it feels pretty good right now but the uh, the weather said it's supposed to get up to 90 so it's gonna be hot it's gonna be humid but uh, we got some fans we're ready to go
Taylor's not here to video, so it's gonna be a little spotty, but we're doing our best. We're gonna vlog, but uh, gotta focus on the race first. Uh, that's first priority, so. So four tests down, two to go. Doing a little better. Just needed to get warmed up, but we're gonna go check on some riders here. Dude, what happened? Dude, I freaking came around the left-hander after we came out of the trees, and I like drug a leg like as far back as you could probably. That was like the worst turn to fall into because there was so many roots and stuff. Well, no, and then you guys came, and I was swirling out. <laughs> like I, I couldn't find my groove at all. Like I was just like. How's the East Coast though? East Coast is sick. Everybody out here is like super rad, so it's been like a fun time. Like coming to these races and being with just like the East Coast vibes of everybody. Like yeah, we're like, cool until you live here. Then we're <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Then we just start toying with each other's vehicles. There you go. That's right. <laughs> Day one complete. Eight second shorts of eight second short of second. That's pretty unfortunate because if I would have got second today, that would have gave me second place points, and I would have been. A little bit better in a better situation tomorrow but um hey that's racing and uh, i'm usually better on the second day anyways so i'm um, looking forward to a good day tomorrow really nothing else to say kind of rode first half first half of the day and then came on strong towards the end but i um, supposed to get a little rain shower here this afternoon and uh it'll change things up quite a bit for tomorrow so excited to uh get undressed go to the hotel and then Start fresh tomorrow. New day. You're late. <laughs> uh, at least I got you a coffee and a water. Thank you. Perfect. So on our way to the track for the final time of 2021. Season finale, this will be our last day of racing. Um, for the year, for sprint duros at least. Um, today's gonna be pretty tough. Um, me and Nelco are tied for second right now, so, you know, whoever beats each other gets second year in. So, um, you know, no added pressure for me really. I'm, I'm pretty good in these kind of situations. You know, yesterday I got a really slow start and then I started climbing my way out of the hole like I always do, but uh, typically, I'm always better day two, um, except for the shoals when I broke my hand, but <laughs> not going to think about it. Just going to uh, try my best and leave nothing on the line. Uh, yeah, we got we to gotta pretty much prove who's the alpha dog between me and Nelco, but nah, uh, we're, we're still pretty good friends, and uh, yeah, whoever, whoever wins, you know, let the better guy win. Okay, so uh, Taylor's not here to do iPhone clips, but luckily we have Aaron. He's, he's gonna get some clips for us today, Sunday, day two. So he wasn't here yesterday, but I'm gonna get him to send me some clips so we have some riding clips for the vlog. And uh, cause that's what everyone enjoys, right? So thanks to Aaron for providing the footage. And uh, yeah, we're gonna keep cycling track and uh, it's starting to mist, right? Yeah. It kind of sucks. Like it's overcast, misty, but I think it's gonna clear over the wind's pretty strong, so hopefully the weather passes by before we start and then it'll be a good day. So, uh, yeah, let's get to it. So just wrapped up test five, going into the last test of the weekend, me and Nelka are divided by 0.7 seconds. It's coming pretty close, but luckily I've been, been faster in the woods test, but yeah. Some controversial things happened test five, which I'm not really pumped about, but I mean, that's just the games that people play during championship battles. But uh, yeah, I mean, the, the payout between second and third championship bonus is quite a bit. <laughs> so uh, obviously we want to get second just, just because we want to do the best we can, but also too, like it's money you can't pass up, right Dylan? You gotta make a living. You gotta make a living. So uh, I start third in the enduro test. You know, I might start fourth or fifth, you never know. But uh, we're going to give it our all, obviously. And uh, 
I shine in these woods tests, especially today. The woods are, the woods are pretty sweet today, so uh, yeah, go in the last test. Not gonna think about it, just gonna ride my hardest. <clears throat> Well, the results are in, and uh, I ended up third. Third for the weekend, third for the day, third on the championship. Uh, lost it by a half a second. So, yeah, it sucks, and uh, <clears throat> kind of feels like someone just killed my dog, to be honest. Like, I don't really have any words. It, uh, you know, this, this season's been up and down for me. You know, coming from breaking my hand and, and uh, you know, breaking my hand at round two and then coming back, you know, two weeks later and having probably one of my best sprint duros to date. <clears throat> Just been an up and down year for me, but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm only human and I thought I rode really good this weekend and uh, I really should have never been in the position to where it came down like this. So, uh, you know, no excuses. <clears throat> I rode great this weekend, and uh, yeah, that's why you got to make sure every day counts and every test counts, and uh, yeah, came up a couple points short. <clears throat>